Hi everyone, this is Bilal Khan and you are watching Simplified Coding. Welcome to another episode of Android Development Tips. And in this video, I will give you one more very useful tips that will help you while building your Android application projects. So Android is basically a front end technology and most of the times we work with consuming APIs. So to hit an API and consume the response of that API, we basically use JSON, the data interchange format. And what we need to do is we need to create data classes to map our JSON structures. Now suppose you have a very complex JSON structure and you need to create data class to map that JSON structure. And if you are doing it manually, then you are just wasting your time. We have plugins to do it automatically. And that is what I am going to tell you in this video. So let's start. This is my Android Studio. And to parse the JSON responses automatically, I will use this plugin. So first click on this Android Studio option and then go to preferences. And here we will select plugin and we will go to marketplace this tab now here we will search a simple keyword that is json to kotlin this is enough i think and this is the plugin that i am talking about it is json to kotlin class we need to install this plugin so let's install and restart the ide now this is my sample json structure that i will parse with the help of that plugin so first we will copy this and you can see it is a nested json structure and you will take a little time if you will try to create data classes for this json structure manually but this plugin will do it in seconds so let's see how we can use this plugin so what i will do is i will head over to my package and here i will go to new and then we will select this option that is Kotlin data class file from JSON and this option you will see after installing the plugin that we just installed. So select this option and paste your structure and now we will write our class name that we want. So I will give a very simple name let's say my JSON structure or whatever name that you want to give to your class. Now click on generate and it will quickly generate all the required classes. As you can see here we have my JSON structure. It has the quest class. Then we have maths class. Here we also have sport class. We also have q1x and here we have q1 and q2. Here is the list. So the class that was required to map this JSON structure is automatically created and this plugin will help you a lot when you are mainly working with APIs. So that is all for this video friends. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did then please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel if you are not already a subscriber and you can share this video with all your friends as well to help me get more subscribers in case you have any problem or any confusion or anything you want to ask me you can simply leave your comments so don't hesitate in leaving your comments below so thanks for watching everyone this is bilal khan now signing off